today we're at the Build-A-Bear workshop. I'm so excited. This is going to be my first Build-A-Bear. Oh my gosh, look at all the exciting things when you walk in. It has clothes and everything. Okay, so basically it's a bear and then or, or any animal that you really like. And then you have to stuff the animal. And then, oh my gosh, look at the selection. There are ponies and doggies and cats and dogs and cats and bears and... And what's that? A sheep, I think. I'm not sure. Okay. So, this bear I have is so cute. Mommy, can I have this one? It's so cute. I could pick out one of these. Oh my gosh, it's a New York Yankee bear. So, basically, it's a sports baseball. And, like, the New York Yankees are really famous. And they have a bear like that. And, look, there are different sections with, like, I think this is a cat. The cat section with all the cat dresses. And then there's sparkling shoes and skirts and clothes. And then there's a pony section. And look at the little ponies and their clothes and their shoes. And oh, this is so exciting. And they come in so many different colors. Oh, okay, so now they're going to show us how to make our bear. Um, so here's a popcorn machine. Oh, it's not popcorn. It's cotton. And once you choose the cotton, you can stuff it into your bear. I chose a pink sparkly cat because I thought it was really cute. And then basically, they take the cotton and they stuff it. And then they put this little heart thing in it, which pumps like a real heart. Isn't that really cool? And Build-A-Bear has many sections too. Not just one. They have a sports section and stuff. And you know, this cotton machine kind of reminds me of a cotton candy machine. So I think that that's where they got the idea from because it's really nice and it has all these different colors and it makes you want to eat it but you can't eat it because it's cotton. And then the sections are divided so there's a princess section and oh and this is the section that they show you where they clean up the bear. So basically there's this machine and you stick your bear like my cat is hanging there and they're going to stuff the cat one by one. The sections are done and they shove cotton into it. So first the head and then the hand and then the other hand and then the leg. And look how nice it's looking now. I did, I chose a really nice cat for myself. It's so interesting how they do all this and they do it right in front of you. So basically after they're done stuffing the cat, you can choose a scent to make the cat smell for the next one and a half years. I chose strawberry because I really like strawberry. I think it smells amazing. Oh my gosh, my cat is almost ready. Doesn't it look cute? So here's all the accessories that are going inside the cat. So basically, first you have to hug the cat when it's ready. This is my cousin Tia, and she's doing it for me. So after you're done hugging the cat, they put this little heart that pumps inside of it. And see, there's Tia handing over all the things. And the lady is basically explaining to her what happened. And she said, before I'm going to put all of this, you have to make a wish. You have to rub the heart and make a wish for little Daria. That's me. And you have to rub it on your heart because it's pure. And then put it on your nose for ever wishful thinking. And then give it a little kiss. And she put it inside the bear cat for me. And it's so sweet. I think it's so sweet. And then... Then the heart goes in. You see this little red heart the woman is holding? That's the one that pumps. So when you put your hand on the cat, then you can feel its beating heart. Isn't that really cool? It's like having a real life cat that sparkles and it's pink. So the lady has put the heart in and she's saying that it's a really new feature and it's like really cool and stuff and I think so too. So now she's putting the scent on my cat. It's that strawberry scent that I told you. Isn't all this really exciting? She's rubbing it all over the fur so it lasts for a really long time. I can't wait. Every time I'll smell my cat, I'll smell like strawberries. That's so exciting. Oh, oh, look, look. She's rubbing it all over the face, too. I can't wait to play with this cat when I get home. Um, okay. So, a little tidbit about Build-A-Bear. When you go in, First, make sure you pick the animal that you like the most, okay? And then you go from there. It's really important. I love cats. So, anyways, 
Now she's done putting all this stuff together, and my Build-A-Cat is ready. Yay! I get to take it home. So here I am in my crib with my Build-A-Cat. I can't wait to show you all the things I bought for Build-A-Cat. So she's wearing this really cute New York outfit. It, it's a little shirt with an Eiffel Tower on it. Oh, it's not an Eiffel Tower. Um, it's, um, it's, a, it's a tower. It's not Eiffel because that belongs in Paris. Okay, so um, she's got these little bows and her glasses, which I picked out because I really like glasses and they're pink and I love pink. And she's wearing this really cute pink skirt and these sparkly tennis shoes because I really like tennis shoes. And, you know, it has all these little um, jewels and stuff on it and I think that's so cute. So you can even pick out um, little things like she can carry a suitcase. Hers has a suitcase, but I, you won't see it here, um, but she has one, and it's really cute because it's got these little stickers from where all she's been, and basically when you buy your Build-A-Bear, they give you a passport, and on the passport, they even give you a visa of where she's been, so now my cat has a visa from New York City. So I told you I like glasses, so I took her glasses, and I just want to see what I look like in them because I think they'll fit and they're really cute and you know it'll make me look really studious like I study already um, or maybe it'll help me study who knows maybe they're magic glasses maybe like you know if you put these glasses on you can turn into a magical being who can read every single thing in the world <gasps> wouldn't that be really exciting I think it would okay so I'm going to enjoy my Build-A-Cat, and in the meantime, if you want to hear or see more about different types of toys, please subscribe, and I'll tell you all about it. Bye!